Hey guys, in this video we're going to be having a chat and just catching you up on all the things we got coming up here at Local Love. Stay tuned. It's Amanda from Local Love, and I am just here to talk to you guys, local Tarians, and just say hello. Sorry, my nose is a little red from having my glasses on. So I look like a hot mess today. I've been busy, 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 as you can imagine, trying to keep everything going for you guys. So I just want to talk a little bit today and just have a chat with you guys and say, you know, here's the kind of things that we're doing. Now, obviously, we're not doing any live events at this time, and we usually only do a few a year as it is. So with COVID still going on pretty strong, we don't feel comfortable doing that. We have decided collectively that it's it's probably not a good idea to do that right now. Uh, are we planning to do something in the future? Absolutely. Uh, could we maybe do an online event? It's something we're considering as well. You know, we just have to, you know, if you have an idea down below on what you'd like us to do, whether you want us to do a trivia or whatever, you know, if you want us to do any kind of like trivia or uh, any kind of live event, uh, you know that involves a contest of any type you know comment down below we're always open to suggestions and we don't hear enough from you guys so please give us a comment and let us know uh, so up until that point obviously without the live events the things you can consider um, for resources besides our videos of course uh, are going to our Facebook page now our Facebook page is local love entertainment Orlando and uh, on that page every day we do post a day's events post. So every day, Monday through Sunday, there is a post up there for the week, for that day. And uh, there's some stuff that's kind of like, you know, recurring, uh, recurring events. But we add our new events there too. Even on the weekends, even though we do a video for the local of uh, Weekend Report we still do a daily event post on our page as well. For those of you that prefer to look through the list and see it by time. Plus, we don't get everything in the video. We do as many as we can manage to get in that video. Uh, there's just not enough time to get that whole list for all three days in there. You guys would not want to deal with it, so we don't want to do that. We want to keep it short and sweet and simple. Um, so yes, so you have the options of going over to our Local Love uh, Facebook page, Local Love Orlando Entertainment is the actual name of the page. And uh, like I said, every day we'll have that event post there and uh, it'll have a huge section that's just like a lot of recurring events or things that didn't have a time slot because they could be any time. Um, we also then break it up into times. So as you go down the list, you'll be able to see that. So if you've never seen our list, you know, check it out. Uh, we also uh, usually give you some sort of motivation at the top, you know, on the post, as well as attaching a video to it every single day. Uh, on top of that, guys, I don't know how many of you noticed this, but we try to share some sort of video about every hour of the day, give or take. Between the hours of 7 a.m. and 8 p.m., we try to do like a, a video an hour that we put in there, not including sharing some of the videos that we've made, other people's videos, just to kind of things, you know, things that might inspire you, things that if you hadn't seen, we want, you know, what we think, you know, th are pretty cool and we think you'd enjoy, craft things, food items, you name it. Like Mondays, Mondays is our Move It Mondays. And on that day, we typically do healthy things, healthy recipes, healthy workouts, health advice, uh, how to, you know, health of your body and your mind. So we try to do as much healthy videos as we can throughout the day, you know, to give you guys some, some path and some motivation and we hope it helps. All right, so we do have the daily event posts on our Facebook page. It's the only place that we print the full list. Um, and then of course, as I mentioned before, on Wednesdays, we upload our local love report. And what is the local love report? For those of you who've never listened to it, every week we have a local love report and uh, it does go up on our page. Um, every single Wednesday, it is our review for the upcoming weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. 
So if you check that video, there'll also be ways to skip to the different days so that you don't have to go, well, I'm gonna be working Friday, I can't go out. Oh, I just want Saturday, man. You know, you can click on those little tabs and go directly to Saturday and enjoy, or Sunday for that matter. Uh, so yeah, check those out. We do it every week and uh, it is a variety of things. We try to pick the, the newest, you know, some of the, some of the stuff that might be interesting that's ongoing, but we also try to include the newest events in that report. Okay, so you're not getting a complete resurgence. Is that stuff still on our local love report or our daily event post? Absolutely. But we just kind of give you a quick condensed way to watch the video. Maybe you're at work and you're on your lunch break. You can watch it real quick. Whatever you want to do, it is up to you. But we appreciate you guys watching. We hope that you guys will give us comments and suggestions on things that you'd like to see. This channel's for you guys. Um, we're not at a level where we make any money on this. We just simply want to entertain our fellow uh, Central Florida people, you know, our local Tarians. So, you know, it is heavily based in Orlando. There are other events. I believe I had some for Daytona and Barry this week. So it really just depends, you know, if it's important enough, then of course we're gonna share it with you. Um, other things that we want to do, like I said, we used to, we usually do a live event, at least one. We usually do the local love fest every year. Well, we didn't do it last year, obvious reasons, and it's not looking good for this year either. So chances are we won't do it, at least not in person. Uh, if I can figure out the best way for us and we can work together on trying to get something together where I can have uh, maybe some musicians performing an, in a venue and then, you know, live stream it. We might consider doing something like that. So if you musicians are out there and you're listening, uh, let us know, you know, reach out to us. You know, you can email us and I'll put that email up here. Well, it'll be on the screen. <laughs> I'll put that email on the screen along with you can message us on our local love Orlando Entertainment Facebook page. That is the best way to reach us. And of course, uh, you can also leave us a message on our Instagram, which is local love underscore now. Guys, I know y'all are out there. You're having fun. You're at work. You're doing things. Share your pictures with us. If you're taking pictures, go ahead and tag local love underscore now. We want to see what you guys are up to out there in Florida. So check it out. Let us know. We do mostly Central Florida, but we're happy to see everybody's. All right, guys, something else that we do, and we try to do this every month. We try to have our uh, Florida Instagram artists to check out. What it'll say to follow, okay? And we try to do that at least once a month. Sometimes it might work out to being twice a month. It just depends. Uh, but we do that. We just released one recently, and I will link that up above. <laughs> so yes, um, we did release that, and of course, we basically um, you just want to go and check them out. You know, this if you're an artist, reach out to us. Let us know. We're always looking for more artists that have not been featured in the video uh, so that you know we can share what you guys do and hopefully you guys out there that are watching will go over to their Instagram page so that you can see all their art because we only share a few pages of their art uh, for each artist and we put 10 artists in there so you know obviously we're not gonna get everything in there um, because it's just there's a lot and we're doing 10 artists and we want to keep the video short enough that you guys will want to watch it. So hopefully you'll take the cue. We also put it in the description on each of those videos, who these artists are and what their Instagram are. And they can be anywhere in Florida. We don't keep it to just Central Florida for the artists. We want to support Florida art. Okay? But, you know, if you're a maker, if you're a creator, if you're an artist, talk to me baby we'd love to hear from you and promote what you're doing we want everybody to see all the great stuff that you guys are up to uh that's just how we are we love to share that stuff so please please do all right so now we've talked about the daily event posts and we've talked about our local love report and we've even talked about events and we've talked about our instagram artists video that we do every month we got one more video 
and it's something else that's going to require you guys if you're out there and you're small business owners i don't care if it's the tiniest little thing i don't need it to be brick and mortar it could be online i do not care do you have an instagram and are you in central florida great we do a video every month or we try to make it every month it's been more lately that we have definitely kept it to at least once a month uh we do a 20 instagrams to follow for orlando okay 20 orlando instagrams to follow and we do that and we try to focus on a variety of things could be a brewery could be donut shops could be jewelry makers if you're any kind of maker okay i don't care send it to me if it's not our cup of tea we'll let you know but yeah reach out to us let us know we are always so excited when you guys interact with us and uh, we in turn love to share what you're doing with other people the artist one is really popular we'd love to see the local small businesses getting even more popular too so if you guys have never checked it out we have full playlists for our artist one we have about 14 episodes of our uh, our florida artists video and for the 20 instagrams you know 20 orlando or i think it's 15 orlando instagrams to follow sorry 15 orlando instagrams to follow that one we have i think we just released our seventh episode so pretty awesome okay some other quick things we want to talk about real quick and then we're going to cut this video we don't want it to be too too long is that we do uh, our oh what a sight okay we haven't done one of those in a minute i think the last one we did was casadega um if you haven't checked that one make sure you do it, it was an interesting day and we got to see a lot of neat stuff and we even went to the cemetery there and i'm sure if any of you are even somewhat familiar with casadega you'll know what that means so you know check it out let us know what you thought we have a lot of neat things here in central florida that we have visited and we have a whole playlist for the oh what a site and we want you to you know check it out because uh we think that it, it's stuff that you guys might want to do maybe you want to take your family maybe just you and your girlfriend want a place to go that's what me and jeff are doing we're going out having our weekend but we're sharing it with you guys that's what it's all about um we even did like a ghost town once right after COVID hit i was like i'm not gonna let this stop me completely from going anywhere i waited about i don't know a couple weeks and then we decided since he's been staying in and i'd been staying in and we hadn't really been going out that we were going to hang out anyway so we decided that we were going to go to a ghost town <laughs> that was my big idea to stay away from people during covid so i hope that you guys saw that and appreciated it as the joke it was sort of meant to be but honestly we learned a lot about the place and it was a really neat trip so make sure you check that one out as well all right guys, so the other thing that we do uh, is called What I Think. So we have a lot of different playlists and we hope that whenever you guys are looking for something to watch that you check them out because they're about your area. If you live here in this area, a lot of these are about your area. They could be local restaurants. They could be uh, me promoting or not promoting, but um, it might be me testing uh, face masks. We've seen a lot of that, I know, and I, I don't think you guys like them that much, but you know, once in a while we find one we like. Uh, we might be, you know, reviewing other things, you know, as far as, uh, I think we did a wish one just a couple days ago, you know, that we shared. And of course, it's just a variety of things that we want to share with you guys. My favorite ones out of those are the ones where we go to restaurants like the Mexican Camel or Smoking Donuts, you know, we got delivered or there's a variety of things that we have in there. But our goal is to let you guys know, here's this thing we're trying and here's what we thought and here's our opinion on what it's like. So we hope that you guys enjoy that. Please leave a comment down below. Let us know literally what you guys think about what we're doing. And as things change or as things get added on, we'll consider doing some online events perhaps or doing something like that. We'll figure it out. See if there's something we can't do to uh, engage with you guys because we miss you, okay? We miss you. We miss seeing you guys. We want to see your little faces. You know, I mean, going out to a live event, like a, a concert, which is our typical thing where we book a show, 
you know, it's so much fun. And we usually have vendors there and the whole nine yards, but we just don't feel that it's going to be simple to put together at this time. You know, not everybody's going to want to come out. If they have to do the mask or if they have to, you know, come out and be around maybe more people than they feel comfortable. And we don't want anybody to have to make that decision on our behalf. That is why we've gone so far in all of our events and, and you know, anything we've shared with you guys to try to include a healthy mix of things that you can do at home and out on the town because not everybody's there yet not everybody's feeling comfortable to go out there and shake it down downtown you know what i'm saying if you are that's totally fine it's absolutely your call guys i'm not telling you what to do i'm just giving those of you that aren't ready an option and i hope you guys appreciate it other than that guys i can't tell you how much we love doing this for you we absolutely enjoy it and I hope that you guys appreciate it. If so, please give us a thumbs up and share us with your friends. We'd love to know, we'd love to meet even more family. All right, local Tarians, I have blathered on long enough, but uh, you know, thank you so much for everything you do guys. We wanna hit 200 subscribers uh, before, before we hit September, that would be lovely. By the end of the year, we'd love to see three, but you know, we, we will do what we can do so if you want to come and join us it's free to like and subscribe we certainly appreciate it but you know obviously we understand if we're not your cup of tea we don't want you to do that it's totally fine the fact you're watching it right now is enough for us so thank you guys so much we appreciate you uh you know thank you so much for being here we hope that you and your family are safe and well and uh other than that peace We'll catch you next time. Hey guys, before you go, we want to tell you about these amazing notebooks and artist books that we are sharing on Amazon. Now we're not sponsored, but we're going to put the links down in the description for the books that you're going to see on this quick advertisement. So thank you so much for your time. We have this lovely raccoon and sloth notebook. And of course our art book is amazing because you can go in there and we give you suggestions on how to get past that artist block. It's a great way to get ideas ideas and one of my favorites is the Arctic great beginnings book which we did and that one's where we're gonna start something and you're gonna finish it so it'll be a lot of fun for you to try that and keep yourself fresh we have these let's talk about it books and of course newest on our list are these beckoning cats with their great phrases and of course these beautiful Mexican folk art tropical fish we have so many great options and you can make it really wild with these animal prints as well as some sushi we got all kinds of great stuff there's more coming if there's some kind of notebook that you're interested in make sure you leave us a comment and let us know what you'd like to see us make next and other than that guys i want to thank you so much for tuning in and uh, all this information will be down in the description and of course we appreciate you just taking a look and other than that guys we're gonna head out for the night. Thank you so much for staying tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share with all your friends. And hit that bell so you know when we have a new video.